here. Go, go put some good in the world. So much bad happens already, you might as well put a little good in. I really would like to meet Beyonce Knowles because first of all, she's a woman of integrity and inspiration for many, many women. And she's a feminist and she's very passionate about dance. So I want the youth to focus not on the image in the mirror, but rather how their image reflects on the community. So when I see little acts of kindness happening, it's just another step towards making the world a better place. We met in kindergarten and then we went to school together for a few years and then he actually was homeschooled until high school. And then one day he walked in and I just was like, whoa, he's hot. Accepted who I am, so I really want to help people with hidden disabilities to become strong within themselves and be able to stand up for themselves. Because it, take, it took me a lot of courage to be able to participate in a speaking competition for the deaf and hard of hearing. Um, I joined this pageant for the very reason that I wish I had the version of myself I am now when I was younger. I would like to empower youth by putting them in charge of this program where we would take in disabled, disabled children, put them on horses for an hour, and lead them around, and these children connect. And um, I never take for granted anything of my family, of my friend, and any opportunity I always say yes. Fruitvale is in the BC interior, in the southern portion on the east side. It's just a little small village, um, but I love it, so thank you. Uh, well, my choice was Mr. Albert Einstein. Not because he made my physics time in grade 11 so torturous, because he did. It's be because he has taught me how he has suffered through so much in school and still he has, he's been able to succeed. At the end of the day, you are an amazing and strong, unique person and you have so much more to fight for.